She coughs all night. Like really, dog? Abby's like, I don't get why she likes that so much. Come on, girls. What are we? We're about to watch the Woman in Black too. For let you all know what that was like. Maya's a scary cat. So. Look, I got my blanket and my pillow. We understand that. I hit play. Why did it not play? <laughs> this is going to really annoy me. I will figure this out. I don't know, but we're going to watch the whole dang movie. I know. Okay. Play. I hit play this time. It's working. Turn the light. Hi, guys. So, new day. Maya's not here with me anymore. She went home. We had a bomb time last night. We did some baton and we watched some movies and went out to eat, so best sister ever. So now I'm just working on some locks of love stuff because my event is coming up in like a week, so I'm like super duper excited to have my locks of love event again. So that's pretty cool. So that's just what I'm doing now. I'm working on locks of love nonsense and this shirt is so annoying because it would look so cute if I had boobs, but I don't have boobs, so it just like falls off of me, and I have nothing to fill it up, and it's extra space, and yeah, it's just like so much extra space and like nothing to do with, so I live the boobless struggle. May 2nd is the day the Battle of Hogwarts took place, and I'm spending this day just looking at my Harry Potter shrine, which sits in the living room in our china cabinet. It's beautiful. Oh. Say hi. Say hi. Wave to the camera. It's all gone. Is it hurting? Yay! Was it pulling? Hi guys. So in that last clip, what you witnessed was something pretty amazing. My grandma donated her hair to Box of Love, and that was her like cutting it off and getting prepared to like send it away. So I just want to take this moment to like let everyone know that if you have hair that's 10 inches, totally do it. Totally donate it. You don't have to donate it to like Box of Love. You can pick any like charity that works with this cause that you want because in the end, it's not about what charity you send it to. It's about sending it somewhere so we can make the wigs for these kids in need. So I just want to take the moment and strongly encourage each and every one of you watching this to go do that because it's amazing. And you miss your hair for a while, but in the end, you'll get used to the shortcut and you'll realize your hair will grow back, so it will grow back. The kids with cancer, their hair won't grow back, and that's why we do this. So I just wanted to let you all know that. And that's the end of this vlog. I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know if you want to see more vlogs from me. And yeah, bye guys. Thanks for watching. <laughs>